I'm gonna make coffee in a mocha pot. Mocha pot is right here. That's part of it. This is an old Italian method of making sometimes called stovetop espresso. It's not an actual espresso because it doesn't uh, use as much pressure as actual espresso does, but um, it's a similar process. It uses steam under pressure. So, put water up to the valve. There's a pressure valve in there to prevent the thing exploding. And you don't cover that up. And put this fil uh, filter in there. I'm going to get some Papua New Guinea coffee. It's a medium roast. set my coffee grinder to espresso which is a very fine setting right there take the top off put the coffee in this is a burr grinder so it makes a nice even grind. And it's good enough to make the espresso. Fill this up. You don't tamp it down too hard just to smooth it over. Okay, now clean off the edge so we can uh, so that this can screw on tightly. take a couple minutes to start boiling or to start perking up. And what, what happens, it's not a percolator. It's uh, the water turns to steam down here and gets forced up through the filter and then up through this little uh, cylinder there and out the top and then it fills up the top of the, uh, the pot. And it makes a very strong cup of coffee. So it tastes a lot like espresso. It's, uh, and I am going to stop it right here and come back when uh, here it comes. Now the water's not boiling yet, but it's, uh, yeah, see, it even makes a crema, like a real espresso. It's a similar process, it's just that the pressure isn't quite as much as, uh, as with a real uh, espresso machine. Okay, I'm 
gonna close this because when it starts to boil, the steam comes out the top and it makes kind of a mess. Makes about a demi tasse worth. About a half of one of these cups. That's very hot, so I gotta wait for that to cool down to clean it. And now, because uh, on Facebook my uh, masculinity was questioned because I drink my coffee with cream, I'm going to drink this espresso straight. No cream, no sugar. And That is very, very good. It really does taste like real espresso. So, that's it.